My name is Christina, and I would like to give you some information about the products of Gherkin Schneider. Anna Hello. will collect your questions from the chat, and I will try to answer them after this speech. The issue of today is light bodies with Shamot. Now, please change to the presentation. Light bodies containing Shamot from Gherkin Schneider, differences, similarities, range of applications. So we have standard bodies with technical information sheets, which you can find on the page potterypassion.com. And we have three different groups, stone war, earthen war, and special bodies. Earthen war is the one which the group which with only two different kind of qualities. In general, I would like to explain the word bodies which we use. And bodies for us means blended clays with or without additives, so raw materials like dolomite or feldspar. And shamot is another word which we use quite often. This is a burnt clay milled to special grain sizes. With another word, you also can say rock. If we compare these three groups, the composition of the body determines the range of application. So stone wall are typical clays from the Westerwald, mineralogical and chemical compositions, mostly light clays and blended clays for high temperatures to 1200 or 1280 degrees. The different weight percentage of shamot or rock in different grain sizes. This determines the range of application and the dense firing. Earthen war are blended clays with or without other raw materials with a special composition for low, lower temperature for 1000 or 1180 degrees. The water absorption of this group is about 10% and the firing of about 1140. And special bodies are blended clays mixed with raw materials to achieve special characteristics. Clay and raw material mixtures with special features during processing or after firing. Features arise through additives in the composition of the body. So the group of stone war body, main selection criteria for the appropriate body. These are the stone wall bodies which we offer in our file. The proportion of shamot and the grain size differ among the bodies. The part of shamot is in general 25 or 40 percent. The bodies with 25 percent are 254, 264, 284, and 478. The bodies with 40 percent of shamot. Are 468, 474, and 480. And the grain sizes are different as well. So the only body that has a grain size from 0 to 0 0.1 millimeter is our body 254, the body that you can use for throwing as well. If the shamot, the grain size of the shamot is higher than that, you usually use it for other application, for other works, but not for throwing. A throwing body is either somewhat free or contains somewhat with grain size 0 to 0 0.2. The shamot provides a good stability on the wheel during throwing, less shrinkage, and therefore also less tendency of warping. Grains of 0 0.5 millimeter or larger are too coarse for throwing. These qualities are versatile and can be used for slab building or coiling. Larger pieces are built up with grain size 0 to 1 millimeter because the grok is a good armature throughout the whole processing. 
very large pieces are built up with 40% of Chamat. So the support gets more effective. Coarse grains can also be used as a decorative element. For stove tiles and raku, you can use our bodies 86 and 441. These bodies are not typical for the festival, but they are needed for special applications, hand building and sculpting. Body 86 is blended clays mixed with other raw materials and is, it is an extremely light body composition. The firing range is between 1000 and 1140. It includes 30% of Chamot, 0 to 0 0.8 millimeter. Body 441 is also a mixture of clays and non-plastic raw materials. The firing range between 1000 and 1180. It has 45% of Chamot, 0.2 to 0 0.8. It is also not suitable for throwing because of this kind of shamat of the grain size. Both bodies do not become dense even if you fire at the maximum temperature. The part of shamat is ex exceptionally high and doesn't fit in our usually glossary. Body 441 has a grain size of shamat which starts at 0 0.2 millimeter. The shamot is dust reduced. Therefore, the green and fire strength is high. Body 441 is used for slab building. The drying is very evenly without warping because of the high content of rock. One of our customers buffs the surface and uses 441 for raku firing. These bodies are taken for raku firing or are used for stove tiles. The high porosity enables good thermoshock resistance and good heat storage. The group of special bodies starts with body two, three, four. This one is a light creamy color body with a firing range up to 1240, a water absorption at this temperature at about 3%. A stone wall body which has special features before firing. The body contains purified cellulose which are worked into the body. This makes the body very insensitive to drying so most transport within the piece is very good. Therefore, already dried pieces can still be attached to either humid or leather hard bodies. The humidity compensation takes place through the cellulose. Cellulose is an organic material. Although it is cleaned, it decomposes after some time. After firing the fiber are burned out and the body behaves like any other body without shamat. Body 267 is also a light and creamy colored body. The firing range goes up to 1150 only. At this temperature, approximately the water absorption will be 2%. It is a low sintering body, like our body 245, which you might know, containing 50% shamot 0 to 0 0.2 millimeter. The shamot counteracts the dense firing. On the other hand, the shrinkage is reduced and the stability during firing is increased. It will not warp as easily as 245 does. The body can be used for throwing and building up smaller pieces. The body fires densely at an early stage. It allows to use of numerous available glazes and is suitable for small objects for the garden.
And the last group we, were to, we are talking about are the special bodies. So body 930 and 931 are very similar. Both of them have a light creamy color with 20% of Shamot 0 to 0 0.2 millimeter. The firing range goes up to 1280. The water absorption at 1240 is already only 1%. A stone wall body whose special feature is the added basalt spots. These black brown spots are visible only at high temperature, about 1200 degrees. They are released by glazes and therefore appear larger and have irregular shape. If no glaze are used, glazes are used, they appear as small black spots on and in the fired body. Body 930 has spots in size 0 0.02 to 0 0.2 and 0 0.2 to 0 0.5 millimeter. Body 931 has only spots 0 0.2 to 0 0.5. Spots of body 931 seem to be larger. It also looks as if there are more of them, although the quantity is the same like in body 930. Another special body is 967.5, a sandy color with 48% of Shamot 0 to 0 0.2. The firing range goes up to 1170. A very special body because the coefficient is very low. low. And because of this, this stonewall body, whose special feature is the thermoshock resistance. The body can be heated as often as required and quenched in cold water. Cooking pots, pans, tajines, table grills, all these um, products can be produced for this body. A skilled thrower can process the body on the potter's wheel. Otherwise, it is suitable for modeling and building up, coil build, slab building, and so on. Body 1112. A light body with 20% of Shamot, 0 to 1 millimeter. The firing range goes up to 1280, and at 1240, the water absorption is 2%. A very light stone raw body, almost as light as porcelain. A basic body is 1100 and added with grok. It contains 20% of kaolin shamot, 0 to 1 millimeter. The shamot is very light and it is visible in the fired body. This body is ver versatile, suitable for large pieces and for outdoor area. Due to the light color of the fired body, all glazes that are applied have a bright appearance. So if you want to look at all these bodies the other way around, you will ask, which body do I use? What do you recommend for which kind of article? So if you have large objects, interior, for tiles, you can use body 86 and 441. For stove tiles, slab building, 468 and 441. For sun lounger and wellness area, all our bodies with high content of somat. For hand building and sculpting, it depends how big, how large your object is. You can have, choose one of the bodies you can see here. 245, 254, of course, only for small pieces. If you want to produce garden ceramic or architectural ceramics for rich turret, you can use different kinds of bodies depending on the, on the largeness of the, of the object. For steels, you should use 474, 478, or 480. 
for sculptures and objects, you have a big range of bodies. For slabs or tiles, you should use 468, 474, or 480. So it always depends on the temperature that you want to burn and on the largeness of the object. This is important for the grain size that you will choose. And the special bodies for cooking pots, for pans or tajine, in any case, 967.5. For large and thin objects, you can use paper clay 234, because after the burning, the clay, if you remember, behaves like a normal clay. So it's only a difference during your work. For low sintering, 267. For effect with spots, 930 or 931. And for architectural bodies similar to porch lane, you should use 1112. Here, you can see some photos of work for stove tiles, which were done with a body 468. Of course, you also can use 441, which we have introduced before. For large objects, interior, you can use 474 or 48, 468. For ceramics for the garden, you have different option, uh, options depending on the largeness of the object. You can use for throwing on the picture on the left on the bottom, you can use the 254. You can use the 468. Or on the right side, they will use the body 474 and 474 for the bowl as well. For architectural ceramics, if they are as large as these, you should use 480, which is a body with a Chamot 0 to 2 millimeter and with 40%. For special ceramics like these pots, which are directly on the fire, you can use 967.5 because of the thermoshock resistance. And these are also special ceramics. These are two objects made with 441. The customer, I told you before, buffs the surface. So it's a very interesting technique. If you have a comparison of all the bodies, in one sheet, you do not see a lot of differences because you do not see them in the color. They are more in the technical kind of data. So you should use our page, potterypassion.com, with water absorption, with coefficient, and all technical data to compare the bodies. Now this is again the page where you can find everything in German language. It is tapferglück.de or potterypassion.com.